I, I, I don't know those things. But certainly, um, now also, not only is the Lamas growth, come on, the celebrating of the, the Lamas growth, but also we have on the left the common oak, wrongly called the English oak, and on the right the sessile oak, wrongly called the Irish oak. These are both native. They came most likely up from Spain and Portugal after the Ice Age. Those of you who are following the current series on, ra on television, I don't have a television and I don't watch television. I don't want to watch television. But my Ulster people who've been with me all week from County Down, they tell me that the most popular programme in the north of Ireland is this RTE television programme about Ireland after the Ice Age. Has anyone come across it? Is it on Radio Nagoya? It's on RTE television. RTE television. Okay, I appreciate to know that. So, the DNA of these trees, general, basically, very basically, after the Ice Age, things began to cool down. Maybe 11,000 years ago, maybe things began to warm up, rather. So, tricklets began, underground rivers began. Great. This library was under two miles of ice for millions of years, till recently 11,000 years ago. So, the ice began to melt and... Billions of cubic metre began to move and take mountains with them and sculpt rivers. That is the Irish landscape. It's a very new landscape. And by the grinding and crushing of rock, the clays were laid down. And where no clays were laid down, because all the mountains of County Cork are flat, do we know why all our mountains are flat? The weight of two miles of frozen ice, harder than granite for millions of years. There is no real pointed mountain in Cork. There is in Kerry. Karen Tool did reach above the deep sleeping ice sheet over the millions of years. Uh, south of us in Spain, the hunter gatherers were painting their caves in southern Spain and southern France. They were painting cows with long horns and they were painting this tree. <coughs> And they, we know it's this tree because no other tree has such a straight line, such a straight line down and very distinct lines. And they say the Oam alphabet came from this tree because there are lots of cave art, 40,000 years old, and it can only be the yew tree. And so we begin to see the beginnings of a new alphabet. We begin to see the beginnings of an alphabet. There is no alphabet on the planet. Uh, and so Owen most likely begins to emerge as the, f as the first alphabet. Those of you who know the Owen, it's based on down lines with lines across. The U is five lines across. The Oak is two lines, three lines from south, west to north, east and so forth. So um, we've got the hunter-gatherers and meanwhile as the ice melts, and the giant, the frost giant, retreats up into Scandinavia. In Scandinavian folklore, they call it the frost giant, which actually is the glacier, the big monster of ice that comes down over the planet and then retreats. It's like breathing. The Earth has a breath. We've always gone from global warming to ice age. We've always done that. There's nothing new under the sun. So at the moment, things are a bit wobbled, perhaps, but I, 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 um, I, I see that climate change is just part of the natural this is the longest period that, that I've heard of or read of where life was able to continue in, Ar in Ireland and Northern Europe it's the longest period for, for millions of years in fact an ice age is due 